Hello world, Lisa Fredrickson, your friend and computer science professor with another short screencast about Access. On the latest version of Access, I've noticed that when I created a query design view, it gives me more fields than I've asked for. So I'm going to create a simple query here from the Northwind Traders sample database. I'm going to use a customer's table, orders, order details, and products. And the reason I want all four of these tables is because I want some information from each of the tables and I need these relationships to link the tables together properly. I want the customer name and their city and state. I want the order ID. I want the quantity and unit price. And I'm going to slip the product name in right here in front of quantity. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six fields. But when I go to data sheet view, I end up with the six fields that I've asked for, customer name, city, state, out of the customer's table, order ID out of the orders table, product name out of the products table, and then quantity and unit price out of the order details table. But if I go to the right, I've got all these other fields. So one way to get rid of them in data sheet view is simply to hide them. So I'm going to click and drag across these field names because it's basically giving me all the other fields from all the other tables. And then right click and hide fields. So that gives me the data sheet view I want, but I'm still irritated that I have to do that. Right now, I'm not sure how to fix that in design view, but with a tiny bit of SQL skills, if I go to SQL view and I get rid of this star, and it seems to be added at the end of the select statement, which means all fields. If I just get rid of that. I don't need the comma there because I don't want any more fields. I don't need the star, which means all fields. If I just delete that, then I go back to data sheet view. I've got what I want. If I go to design view, I've got what I want. Back to data sheet view, it's behaving the way I want. Now, how to get rid of it in the beginning, I've yet not solved, but this is how to just clean it up. And that is to go to SQL view and delete that last comma and star, which means give me all fields. Thank you.